Charles de Gaulle Airport, just arrived. The time right now is 20 past 7 in the evening and our flight leaves at what time? 10. Did you remember to say good evening to the viewers? Good evening. We are about to fly from Terminal 1 here at Charles de Gaulle Airport. We'll be flying with Scandinavian Airlines to Copenhagen where we should be landing a little bit past midnight. So we're going to be pretty exhausted after this flight and this trip. But uh, join us as we check in, walk around the airport, fly with SAS and head home. Let's go. Yeah. And in we go. First things first, find out where we're going to be checking in from. It's Qatar anyway, straight ahead of us. There's the board. Go down to the end. Then we have a large area, check in area. So we've got to go around. It is a circular terminal. I haven't seen any screens yet for the check-in gates. And I take it we should find our check-in area somewhere around here. Mato will put a little bit of a speed on, as I always say. So we can get some. There we go. We've got some boards up ahead. Yeah, Mato, straight up. Here. There we go. Copenhagen. 70 to 78 on time it says. There we have our SAS flight, second from the bottom. 22.05 in the evening, SAS SK 1560. Check-in hall is check-in hall 4. And boarding gate 70 to 76 and our flight is on time. It's off to... Hall four we go. Just straight ahead. Just look a, a little look, look around us as we're walking. We film the whole walk actually so you can see what it looks like here at Terminal 1. First time we're actually walking here, Mauro and I. Last time we went Charles de Gaulle Airport, we were doing a transfer. And I believe it was Terminal E and it was an Air France flight, but it was far away from this terminal. Interesting to see what it looks like. Still straight ahead is Hall 4. Let's see, it's going to be quite a distance to get there. Our SAS flight is a Star Alliance flight. And I take it that all of the Star Alliance flights are well, basically only international flights other than Air France probably leave from this terminal. Just ahead there's also a tax refund, I can see. And here to the left, not sure what airline this is checking out, Egypt there. To our left, Turkish Airlines straight up ahead. And the tax refund. Hall 4, where's Hall 4, Maro? 1, 2, 3, okay, it says up there on the sign. Hall 4 straight ahead. So, straight ahead we go. 5 and 6. Ah, there's Hall 4, and there's SAS. Self service baggage drop. Yeah, let's go in. There is a self service. Found hall four now, so it's a self-service check-in. Near the self-service automatic check-in machines. There we go. Maro's doing the honors today. Maro's probably just going to be typing in our ticket number. So now we've got our boarding cards and our baggage slips. We'll just have to put them on the baggage and we'll take them to the drop-off. 
the baggage labels on. Let's go and drop them off. So now we've checked in our baggage. Now it's time to find out where security is. Pass through to the other side and relax a little bit, maybe. Yeah. Our gate's about 70 to 78. So we have to go in this direction. I was just packing away our boarding passes, where we just had to check what gate number it was. It's not the easiest system here. If you're new to this, just remember to check your boarding pass. We only saw one screen telling where the gates were after you've checked in, but there's a big sign up there ahead of us. Gates 10 to 78. And there we're probably going to have to pass the security control from that area. It's also security down there. Is it down there, Mara? Straight ahead of us. It says here too. Yeah, there. There is over there. Let's go there. So is that to the left? 10 to 10, 7. 10 to 78. Go down to the right. Down to the right, then up. There we go. We have to scan our way in, I can see. Okay, so that's us in there. Up we go. It's a nice tube going upwards again. It's a very bouncy floor. As we make our way up into the departure area. Attention, moving way ends in 15 meters. There we go, and we've made it. So, we're just following the signs. Gate okay, is 78. As you can see, straight ahead of us is also gate 78. Still following Maro. He's going to be putting a speed on any second. A turbo boost we all know so well. And she should be able to do on that. Travelator. I love these travelators at this airport, they're very nice. The whole room is very nice. They've made it well. I'm hot on Mardo's heels here. I better slow down a little bit so I can get her little feet moving forward there. At high speed. Lucky she didn't hear me saying that. Oh, she did hear me saying that. Going down a little bit and straight ahead we go. And there at the end it goes uphill again. I was just pointing out the artwork here of Paris. Have a look at that before we begin Looking upward. I thought that was somebody rushing, it was actually just a little kid playing, running very fast with his luggage. You can hear him coming up behind me. Let him flank me as right, so I move to the right, to the left. His mother just told him off, so he's not coming that fast behind me after all. I think we can go around them. Let's do a little uphill here and stretch our legs. There we go. And up we go. Getting a little workout here. It's 70 to 78, straight up here above us. And security controls here, so I'll turn the camera off for now. Now we've just passed through security. And see our gate is not available yet, so we're just going to do a little walk. There's big Air China passing by the window behind me. Let's go to the left here, Mara. That's what it looks like after passing, passing through security. Nice sitting areas. Let's do a little round. Oh, it stops here? Yeah. Okay, it's very small. It's just the exhibit gates, that's all. Is that what it is? Yeah. You can see there's some arcade games over there. 
let's go and have a look at the windows and oh, we can't even see much. Yeah. the rest of it, we probably need it. Yeah. anything. Well, let's go down and have a look. If you stay a little bit to the left, outside. And this little restaurant area we have here. Riroche Turi. You must be tired of hearing my bad French by now. I promise you it's the last time you get to hear it for this trip. Little relay kiosk. Let's just keep going to the end, Mara. Let's see what there is to see here. You can all see what this airport looks like. And then we have the end there again. And the SAS lounge is just down there at the end. Let's go down and have a look at that. And it looks like we have a tax free shop here. Tax free shopping. And the SAS lounge. No, you can't pay access for that. Success Lounge. You can ask about silver card here. So, it's not much here in this departure hall. It's very small, as you just saw. Mara is just buying herself a little snack. I had some chocolates on the way. We just found a little area here to perch in this very little airport while we wait for the gate number to be announced. Not that there's many choices here. It's basically here all around the corner. <laughs> Looks like our plane out there. Morning has begun. And off we go.